What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Hello everybody, this is Bulldozer, and thank you for giving me your time, and thank you for watching another one of my videos. I really do appreciate you taking time out of your day to watch this. We're going to be talking about a couple of the new items we got in the new update 12.30. And these items are really, really cool. Got to play around for a little bit, you can see some gameplay in the background. But before we get started, if you would, please consider using my code MrBulldozerGaming. You see it in the center of your screen, also in the lower left hand corner of your screen. I am an epic partner that is confirmed with that green check mark right there. So every time somebody makes a purchase, I do get a kickback from that if they use my code. Once I receive a cash payout from Epic Games, I will be doing a giveaway. Will it be V-Bucks? Will it be skins? Who knows? But I need you to use my code so I can get that cash payout and that way it will allow me to do a giveaway on the channel. So again, please consider using my code, Mr. Bullers of Gaming. I would really appreciate it. Thank you. Let's get started with the two new items. We got a crash pad and this umbrella. Um, Kingsman, I think is what it's called. And it can deflect bullets. You can use it um, to hit people with it. And I mainly use it to fly around with, as you can see right here. I've gotten it out of the vault, which you'll see here in a second, and I've also eliminated somebody and got it from them, which you'll also see in this video. The other thing is the bounce pad. The bounce pad is one of the best things I think they've added to the game, to be quite honest with you. Uh, it makes it, you know, let's say you're somebody like me who doesn't like to build a lot, I can throw that bounce pad up and it's going to get me up in the air enough where I can put out a flat, a flat platform and I can take advantage over somebody's builds. I'm somebody who likes to use people's builds against them. And it also helps you get up on the second floor of buildings too, instead of having to go up the steps on the inside, which you'll see a clip of that in this game as well. So let's go ahead and get started. How you can see how I got my first umbrella. We're here on the yacht. We're gonna go into the vault and we're gonna get the umbrella out of the um, supply box that is in the vault here on the yacht. You can see right there, you can't miss it. It is a really bright gold. And apparently this yacht is going to be turning into Deadpool's yacht. I cannot wait for that to happen, folks. Friday is going to be here before we know it. And if you have not seen the version of Deadpool we are getting, check this out. I absolutely love this look. This is absolutely sick. It has a zombie feel to it. Cannot wait. But again, back to this video here, we're going to be taking and showing you on how to use the new umbrella and the bounce pad and how it's effective. One thing I haven't done yet is I want to get up in a helicopter and jump out of the helicopter and see if I can use the umbrella, which I'm sure I can. Uh, I've already used it jumping off of like the top of a, of a mountain and stuff. So I'm pretty sure I can use it jumping out of a helicopter. I've showed you the umbrella. Let me go ahead and show you what the bounce pads look like. You can see two of them right here. Don't know if they was already here or if they came out of the chest. Or if maybe somebody had them and you know took something they got out of the chest. Actually, it's not called I call it a bounce pad, it's a crash pad, excuse me. Stand corrected. Crash pad. Still. I I mean this just it's like a huge trampoline this thing puts down in a square formation as you see it right there I mean it is really really big and you're gonna see a clip here where I use like three or four of them in a row and it just helps you get across the map so so much and then on top of that when you use the crash pad and you get launched you've got that fall damage protection you get that glow that you have um, so no matter how far away you go and same thing with the umbrella um, you have that fall damage resistance. And just to show you, they don't always come out of the vault. Here I'm, I'm hiding in a box waiting for somebody to bring the key card to me. 
and they'll be coming in from your screen here from the left in a second. As soon as they put the key card in, I will just go ahead and eliminate them. Thank you for bringing the key card to me, making it easy for me to get into the vault. And I got another bounce pad too, if you saw it there on the left hand side. So I should end up with two bounce pads. But again, I haven't read the, pa the patch notes or anything, so I'm not really for sure on where you get these things at. But I just want to show you that, you know, I don't get an umbrella in here, but I do get a crash pad. So again, you know, the first time I, got, I came to the vault, I got the umbrella. The second time I came to this vault, I've got the crash pad be nice to get the crash pad and the umbrella in one vault that would be really nice because they really do work hand in hand together um, if you jump off of a cliff or whatever and hopefully maybe jump out of the, el the helicopter and just before you land you throw down that crash pad and it's going to allow you to leap further and go across more of the map which would be really nice be interested to see on how this will work or if it's even in Team Rumble because once you get launched you can go into glide mode which you can get even uh, more distance but you cannot go into a glide mode it will literally only bounce you from one place to the next and here I'm going to use the bounce pad and you'll see what I'm talking about throw it down and you see how much you can get now I wasted one there you gotta wait till you get almost to the ground and then you hit it again I threw that one in front of me, but you got an idea to see what it looks like. Now we're in here, and I hear somebody, so I'm going to hide in the hay stack. Or circle, whatever the hell you want to call it. I turn around, and the person's basically looking right at me. So I take them out, and they have the umbrella now if that was me instead of me using my pickaxe to hit that hay I would have used the umbrella because the umbrella is a weapon but again you can see how brightly gold colored that umbrella is there's no way you're going to miss it if you eliminate somebody and they have it because it is definitely going to stick out so I'll go ahead and pick it up Go ahead and get this large shield. So let me know down in the comments, do you like the umbrella? Have you had a chance to use it? Have you had a chance to use the, cross pad, the, the crash pad yet? Now watch here, here's a prime example on, on how this comes into play. You can see just how much air I got there. You really do pick up a whole lot of air. Now here I get into a gunfight, and I have another person shooting at me, I don't know, I can hear the shots, I know it's not this person here because I don't see his shots, I can hear the shots in my headset, so I take off and use the umbrella. Now if I was to throw down a crash pad, if I had one, then went into that umbrella, which I'm not even sure if you can go into the umbrella once you're gliding from the crash pad, that'd be worth, you know, trying. But if I was able to do that, I probably could have went on over that hillside and possibly not got eliminated there. But I went ahead and showed the rest of this footage because the person uh, does end up winning the game. Why not? It's that close to the end. Congratulations, GG's. Also, if you would do me a favor, leave a comment down below. Let me know, you know, are you glad you finally got something new in the game? Um, if you've had a chance to use these, what do you like about them, what do you don't like about them? And also, do you think this season is going to get extended? Because I really do believe this season is going to get extended. We're talking about a whole new season. And the fact that everything going on with the CV right now, I think it's just going to be really hard for them to keep their, I think it's April 30th in the season date. Um, but there has been some other stuff that um, has come up that I've, I've heard mentioned on Twitter that I didn't put it in this video because I didn't have footage of it. Um, apparently there is some things around the agency in the water. I'm not sure what they are, but they're little, um, little structures underwater with a, um, looks like a metal lid to them, possibly. 
and some people were thinking that maybe they could be another way to get around the agency possibly go from one location to another because um, it's in the water I haven't noticed it anywhere else but again um, leave a comment down below tell me what you think about that and are you ready for this season to be over with do you kind of feel like what he feels like uh, he wishes he had our old map back Again, please consider using my code Mr. Boulder to gaming. And if you do so, make sure you send me a picture over on Twitter so I can give you a shout out in any future video and videos. Thank you for giving me your time, I really do appreciate it. This is the Bulldozer. Get your killing on, and I'm out of here. Thank you for watching. Here's some more videos you might be interested in on the left hand side the Fortnite playlist. All the videos I've uploaded this season for Fortnite. On the right hand side, the previous video. Who knows what that video can be? Could be Fortnite, could be something else. Thank you for watching. This is the Bulldozer. Get your killing on. I'm out of here.